Hello everyone, welcome back to another episode of Cold Start and today we're taking a closer look at the 2018 Toyota Camry. Let's roll the clip. Welcome back everyone. I hope you all enjoyed the cinematic video we did for the Toyota Camry. And today we're taking a closer look at some of the key features and highlights that I really enjoy in the all new redesigned Toyota Camry. Now this model we're looking at today is the XSE model, which is the top of the line. SE stands for Sports Edition. The Camry, the word Camry has a very, very interesting background. It is Japanese for crown giving that luxury, sophisticated uh, feel, at the same time remaining the sport element in it as well. Now, taking a look at the entirety or the outside of the car, you'll notice a brand new front bumper, brand new rear bumper, brand new everything. Now, the XSE model has an upgraded bumper from the previous trims, giving that, again, more aggressive, more sporty look to the overall of the car. Looking at the front, you'll notice LED daytime running lights and LED headlights, an upgrade from the previous uh, generation. And underneath the bad center badge, you'll notice a front camera in there as well, giving you that 360 view of your car, which we'll see later on when we get inside. You'll also notice these four sensors in the front bumper as well to help you uh, mitigate some, some collision damage if there's any, or help you prevent any damages uh, if, if possible, right? Moving along the side of the car, you will notice this gorgeous, stunning aluminum alloy, 19 inch, two tone wheel painted silver and black slapped on with some nice Michelin rubber. Moving along the side of the vehicle, there's a curvature in the side skirt over here that kind of completes the overall look of the car following the lines and finishing right here in the rear bumper. That's something that I really noticed in Lexuses and this one kind of reminds me of the entry level IS 250 or even IS 300, uh, maybe even F Sport, right? So looking at the rear bumper guys, you notice again, more sporty things on the XSE model. One is the black painted uh, spoiler. Number two are the rear diffusers right here, pairing that with a quad exhaust and of course they added an additional fins on the side of the bumper here giving that overall wider stance more aggressive look for the toyota camry here's something interesting that i noticed on the rear bumper it's a little bit soft and when you press on it it kind of goes in i think and I may, I may be wrong, but I think that if you were to back into someone or if you were to hit someone, the damage may not be as much or it may not have as much impact on the pedestrian or whatever because this material is a little bit softer on the rear bumper. Now, let's talk about one of the most exciting feature on the outside and that's what's underneath the hood. It is a 3.5 liter V6 engine giving you 301 horsepower and pairing that to a brand new eight speed, so smooth transmission in the Toyota Camry, giving you that raw power as well as remaining elegant, luxurious, and that comfort that Toyota has known for. Now, Toyota is actually one of the only manufacturer that actually stayed with naturally aspirated engine. As you can see, let's say cruises, uh, Civics, they all have turbos in them but this one do, did remain kind of that raw power, naturally aspirated engine, giving you the power right away when you put the foot onto the throttle. 
Before we get inside guys, here's one last key feature on the exterior that I really, really enjoy. It's what's underneath the mirror. You also have an additional camera right here, again, giving you that 360 degree stitched picture once we take a look on the inside. Okay guys, come on inside. Before I get in guys, I just wanna talk about the seat. Uh, it is obviously uh, made in leather, finishing off with some white stitching all around the seat as well as all around the car. It has kind of a bit of a two-tone with a, with a stripe down in the middle for the front driver's seat. I'm gonna get in. Of course, these are power adjustable seat as well. Front, back, you know, uh, forward, backward, et cetera, et cetera. So what I wanna talk about first on the interior, guys, is what's on the right of me, which is the brand new infotainment system. It has a gorgeous V-shaped design. Um, I think that's very modern, very sexy, at the same time, very elegant. There is a brand new Ontune 3.0 app suite, which is right in front of you. Uh, it kind of gives you two kind of emotions, either you hate it or you love it. Unfortunately, guys, I did not have a very good experience with the Ontune 3.0 app suite. Now the Toyota Camry is the first model that Toyota put in for the Ontune 3.0. You're gonna have your uh, nearby fuel gas stations, sports scores, traffic, weather, Yelp reviews. Why are you gonna look at Yelp reviews in front of your infotainment system, right? And of course, on the second screen, you have your stock prices, which I think is a little bit weird, in my opinion, to have it as part of your app suite. Now, this does require you to download the app on your phone, which is also an additional step that I don't wanna do with the car. So if I were to ever, if, I, if I'm a sales guy and I wanna show this car off to a potential buyer, I have to manually download the app on my phone to really show off this feature. Now, the only feature that does not have this is the XLE trim level, which uses the satellite to display all this information. Now, this do use your data. And of course, guys, data in Canada is very, very expensive. And I'm sure this will eat up a lot of your data very quickly. And the Scout is actually the navigation on the XSE model. As you can see, unless you turn it on with your phone, you can't get an overview map of the GPS system, which is really, really frustrating. And you have to put in something for it to show up on some sort of map. Uh, the rest of the technology guys in, in the front is actually very, very sleek and very elegant. Of course, you have your dual zone climate control over here and uh, you have your brand new screens. You have Sirius XM, which comes with the uh, Toyota Camry. And you have the backup camera, which shows 360 degree of your entire surrounding. Uh, you can change your views over here a little bit closer and a little bit further away. You, you can also change up the lines on the, on the uh, rear view camera as well to better assist you. And of course, if you turn the wheels, the lines turn with the wheel as well. Pretty standard stuff on today's technology. Moving down, guys, you're gonna have your uh, shift knob over here. Now, this is paired with a pair of paddle shifters, pairing that to a brand new eight-speed transmission. Below it, you have your eco, normal, and sport mode, and uh, heat assist on the right side of it. But what's in front of you is actually a wireless charging pad, which I think is, again, finally, a technology feature that you should put in. Look at that, the phone is charging, right? Now let's talk about what's in front of you and behind the steering wheel. You have five different maps or five different screens that you can play around with, guys. Number one is your fuel economy and your trip information. Number two, you can see your driving support, which um, sets off your lane keep assist and your uh, cruise control. Number three is your audio settings, which you can control your audio uh, settings from here in direct relationship to the infotainment system right beside you. Number three are your safety system status. It will tell you what's on number one pre-collision system parking assist blind spot monitoring rear cross traffic alert guys there's so much safety te safety technology inside this camry and number five which allows you to, to turn on and off these safety features number one you can see the blind spot monitoring which if i turn on and off the light will show up and that will kind of indicate to you that if the car is nearby you the light will show up and you know don't turn don't turn into the next lane moving in front of me guys is the steering wheel is leather wrapped feels very nice onto your hands and there's some buttons that i want to discuss a little bit further number one is your uh bluetooth and um, talking function you can answer your calls right here and beside that you have your driving buttons which is your cruise control your lane keep assist and your front of collision warning uh buttons there are some buttons on my left side, which is your high beams, um, 
your automatic daytime LED running light buttons over here. You have your traction control light. You have your camera allows you to see the 360 degree view that we talked about with the three cameras in the front, underneath the mirror and behind in the trunk as well. Look at that beautifully displayed uh, bird's eye view of your Camry. And beside it, you have your trunk release and your uh, fuel gas cap as well. Last but not least, looking up ahead guys, you have your auto dimming rear view mirror with your electronic compass engraved onto the glass. And on top, which is I think brand new for the Toyota Camry, is a SOS safety contact button widely used in BMWs just in case something happens in an accident, whatever, whatever. And finishing that off, is your panoramic sunroof very very gorgeously displayed in the Toyota Camry and that's about everything that I really like on the interior of the Toyota Camry guys and I really encourage anyone to really sit inside and feel this brand new 8-speed automatic transmission so smooth so comfortable at the same time so quick giving that 3.5 liter v6 raw power down to the pedal right away where you need it so that's it for me guys, i see you next time on another episode of Cold Start. Sexy, luxury, sport, comfort, everything one in the all new Toyota Camry.